Um, we're part of a heritage lottery fund um, um, project and what we're trying to do is encourage as many people to come to the church and learn about the heritage of the estate, village and church. And obviously Heritage Open Day has been a national event was something that we really wanted to take part in. This is um, tomorrow. We're going to be opening up the church for the day and we're going to be offering lots of family activities so we'll be offering tours of the church we've got a very exciting lego tower challenge and there will be a lego prize for the winning team we've also got some trails for children for the younger children we've got um, a hoot the owl trail uh, so children will be exploring the church looking for little knitted owls and for the older children we've got a detective's trail we're going to be doing craft activities um, inspired by our beautiful stained glass windows and also by the tiles. And also um, we're going to be offering tours in the afternoon to the ringing chamber, which is normally closed to the public. And people should be able to have a chance actually ringing the bells. We encourage people to get involved in the actual um, services and fundraising and things for the church in general but through the Heritage Lottery Project we are able to involve more people and we hope lots of people get involved in the heritage activities that we're running. This is the last event that we're holding before we close for building works. We have the Heritage Lottery Project and we're delighted and very grateful for the money that's come from Heritage Lottery Fund and that's enabling us to do some building work, new heating, new lighting and so the church will be closed for quite a few months while that work's done so it is an opportunity to come in tomorrow to have a look at the church and also on the Sunday services this Sunday before we close for a few months.